maybe one of those strange and interesting plants prominently displayed and advertised for the child business. Oh, I'm afraid it isn't feeling very well today. There. Now, isn't that bizarre? Now, at least, what kind of weirdo plant is that, Seymour? I don't know. It, it looks like some kind of fly trap, but I haven't been able to identify it in any of my books. So, I gave it my own name. I called it an Audrey too. That's to me. I hope you don't mind. Uh, you see, sir, if you put a strange and interesting plant like this in the window, maybe? Maybe what? Well, do you have any idea how ridiculous you sound? Just because you put a strange and interesting plant in the window, people don't suddenly... Excuse me, I couldn't help noticing that strange and interesting plant in the window. <laughs> what is it? It's... it's an Audrey too. I've never seen anything like it before. Well, no one has. Where did you get it? Well, you remember that total eclipse of the sun a couple of weeks ago? And I heard this strange humming sound like someone from another world. And once again, I found this strange plant just sitting there. Just fucking it all amongst the cities. Audrey Tuck. I could have sworn it had been there before. But the old Chinese man stole this in the anyway. Fifty dollars. Fifty dollars? Fifty dollars? Yeah, come on, right away. Can you break a hundred? A hundred? Uh, no. I'm afraid we closed the register for the day. Well, I'll just have to take twice as many. Twice as many? Twice as many? A hundred dollars worth right away. Audrey, can you hear dear? Thank you, lady. One hundred dollars worth of our finest red American roses. Thank you, sir. That is one 